The last Deoxys, um, or this one right here, the normal one, uh, attempts to pick up Zero Saber with struggle. Oh, and he does. His, his noodle arms. His noodle arms wrap around his neck, lift him into the air, and throws him at Lavi and Luna. Zero Saber goes um, up. Can Lavi just try and grab him, like intercept him? Yeah, roll strength. Oh, that okay. felt weird. Did we just move? <laughs> yeah. I put Zero Saber down. Okay, so it is Dororo's turn. Uh, okay. Go after, uh, this guy. Use faint attack. Alright. In that exchange, Zero Saber dropped his sword. He was very disappointed. This? It's right in front of the Deoxys. Yeah. Ooh! Uh, it cannot miss, though, so it does not matter. <laughs> Alright. Uh, <laughs> Dororo charges forward with his sword, and as the Deoxys attempts to block it, he quickly ducks and swipes at his legs. Um, taking another... 20 damage. Uh, that Deoxys is barely conscious, just covered in various injuries. You feel not much else would knock it over. Houdini's turn. Houdini is... I might as well just hit this one here with the biggest move Houdini's got, okay. which is... Uh, Psybeam. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, Psybeam hits it square on. It just unfortunately does not do much. That Deoxys yeah. just kind of shakes it off. Burb is still down, armor is zero. Uh, Psychic's his sword back to him and flips it again. Nice. Uh, speedy one. Seeing as how his prey has uh, left him and he's really outnumbered, he will stick around and lean back a bit and fire a Psychic at Luna again. No, Psychic is every other turn. He will fire Swift. All right, 35, Luna. I can't, inter I can't intercept that, can I? Um... You know what? Since your teamwork has been so good so far, you could take half of it. E. All right, Lavi takes half of that for you, and you take the other half. So each of you take, let's say, 17. He's going to run up to this one. He's going to run behind it. He's going to wrap his arms around it, and he's going to, like, German suplex it as hard as he can. Roll struggle. Uh, tell you what, yep, it, it'll, it'll succeed. All right, you run up to it, German suplex it right into the ground, it slams really hard, and just kind of slumps in your arms. It is down to exactly one hit point. Yeah, we've been on the ship a little too long. <laughs> Luna, kick it in the balls! Okay! It is Luna's turn. Kick it in the balls. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, Luna, you go up and basically deliver a non-lethal coup de gras and KO it. Yeah. <laughs> Teamwork. High five. <laughs> Jade, you sense that only one presence has control is contesting your control of the ship. I'm gonna do a I'm gonna try to take control back completely. Uh I wanna try to take control of the ship back. Yeah, Very well. Roll it all. Oh yeah. You wrench oh, control yes. of the ship directly from the last Deoxys. He gets a load of psychic feedback and takes the remainder in damage. Heck yeah. Uh the rest of the team, you notice that the ship stops and Jade uh, just kind of immediately alerts you. In fact, you actually get a text message from uh, Deccans that the ship is now yours and this last Deoxys is just on its last legs. Huzzah! How are the rest love, of you. Oh. love you approaches the Deoxys so it starts cracking his knuckles like, all right, mate. <laughs> uh, it starts to go back a little, uh, clearly outmatched and outnumbered. It's not quite sure what to do, uh, but it looks like it wants to make a dash for it. Now, Jade, you saved the ship, yes. However, entering your room... Okay. Entering your room... Oh, f*** you! <laughs> ...is a very confused-looking Deoxys. Uh, hey, dude! <laughs> hey, um... buddy! <laughs> You're just kind of standing there with a Genesect hooked into your computer, a doc like a, another alien, like mind melding with you, and you're standing there in a bikini. Like what you see, boy. <laughs> <laughs> um. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. I, I'm. I'm not gonna. I'm not going to. Uh, can I just have Deccan's attack this thing like immediately? <laughs> Uh, what's its speed? <laughs> uh, sure, just roll it. Oh my god! Oh! Oh, oh, oh freaking Furious Deccans! Oh my god! Yeah! So that... <laughs> I... Deccans are pissed! 
Deccans picks it up and like twirls it. Don't you touch my pika? lady. Pika? <gasps> <laughs> twirls it into the air and pile drivers it down right into the floor. It yeah. lands upside down, face in, uh, face into the metal, and Deccans just hops off, turns around, and just walks back to you. <laughs> like dealt with. <laughs> good, good job, baby. <laughs> Like it's, it's, it's Avengers. Like I'm a god, you dull creature. And I will never. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Oh my god. Um, <laughs> let me. I. You know what? For comedy's sake, no. <laughs> like you may have legit killed this thing. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say because it was a bug type move. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty. Dead. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Okay. Wow. Okay. <laughs> it's pretty hardy. <laughs> you just go back to the, operating the ship. Okie dokie. Cool. Good job defending us, seconds. Very good job. I hit him on the head. <laughs> it gives you the smile emoticon. Yay! My baby. Back at the bridge. The last Deoxys starts retreating, unsure of what to do. It senses that its last comrade has been defeated. It doesn't want to attack you, but it is in no, uh, no mood. No. <laughs> Sorry? <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> no, what do you do? I was joking when I said Pokemon, but now I'm not so sure. <laughs> uh, me, how about just have Doro and uh, Houdini just double team him? Uh, sure. And just lobby. <laughs> roll. Sure, and lobby if you want to get in there, and you lobby, can do yeah. it too. <laughs> uh, three people. I believe, yeah, this is the speed one, so tell you what, just roll a d20 and add six on top of whatever you'd roll. Uh, okay. Between the, lot of you, yeah, between the lot of you, you all kind of jump on him, and he's actually wriggling really, really hard. He flings Lavi off into the computers. Uh, Luna, uh, you approach. This thing just seems to be holding on, and it's it's still still a Deoxys. Still really strong. I kick into the balls. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I'm, kid I'm kidding, I'm kidding. No, he's still strong, like you said. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Uh, Ugh. well, let me get, can I tell Armor to go in front of me? <laughs> Just, I don't want to get a psychic blast from this fucking thing. Yep. It's in front of you. Okay, good. We I still don't got, don't forget, we still got Reflect on us as well. That is that true. That is true. We never but use I, it. I, I can't really attack. I don't, I only, I mostly have, like, uh, summoning, I mean... summoning things. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I guess just just kick it until it's down. Yeah, eventually you guys <laughs> just dog pile on this poor thing. And... Well, here is it I... is it weak enough? Let me let me throw a ball at it. Why not? <laughs> yeah, uh, you throw the pokeball and uh, the Deoxys, despite being held down by as much as it is, knocks it away into the wall. Uh, oh well. Your Styler lights up, thinking maybe. Okay. Uh, roll it with a minus twenty. All right. Tell you what. Between you and your friends, you manage to rank. It's not like mastered through the stylus, but it is contained. Contained. I lassoed it. You have, <laughs> la yeah, you've effectively hog lassoed it. it. Yeah, hogtied it. Very good. But yeah, it is by no means mastered. It is still a rabid Deoxys. So I just have this thing tied up, just going like. <laughs> Essentially, <laughs> yes. I want to punch it in a minute, just trying to knock it out. Well, my my <clears> stylus is <throat> not really a like a rope though it's like a charm that goes around it uh, yeah I mean, it's kind of hard to describe how do you hog tie a poke lavi lavi oh. takes his spaghetti arms and hog ties him with his <laughs> own spaghetti arms <laughs> either way well it's, it's he, he's just kind of there but he's like aloof yeah he's, he's like trapped. whatever yeah there we go i'll give it that to mark that it is no longer you pig knight tied it there you go the ship is yours, and uh, you have one Deoxys contained, and two other KO Deoxys, and a passed out burb. Victory is ours! Yeah! I'll tie up burb. I don't trust him, <laughs> even if he's dead. Alright, you Crazy. get to him. He is on death's doors. In fact, he is dying. In between the beating that you guys have given him and the virus that he's been infected with, um, you're not certain he may uh, last the uh, like the next couple minutes even. Aw, that's sad. <laughs> <laughs> what were you laughing at that? You don't seem conflicted. You don't seem very like. No, I was sad. <laughs> well, I mean, give me a break. We just we kind of just did something that I didn't think was gonna work out well. So. So he's got he's got a 
You say he's got a, d- a virus. He's 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 crazy. Yeah, the moonstone mm. made him crazy. Yeah, you act, for when t- you touched the moonstone, you got infected with the virus. It just didn't get enough time to make you go crazy, Lobby. Other treatments. Yes. <laughs> Lavi uh, is definitely not crazy. <laughs> well, I guess I guess I'll ask Armor. I mean Zero what he wants to do. Uh, Zero at this point is just kind of defaulting to you. He's like, uh, he was crazy, but uh, it it doesn't feel right to end him. If you could save him, please do. Maybe you've got a Pokeball still, right? Yeah, I don't know if I want to use it though. <laughs> <laughs> well, he says, what about that magic thing you got there? He points at your Styler. I mean, the last time we healed him, he went crazy. He shrugs and says, well, um... I mean, it sounds like he's gonna die anyway. We can give him a proper funeral and just send him out to space. He, he thinks for a moment and says that might be the best thing for him. Yeah. I Jade, mean, we, uh, gave, we were... gave him a second We gave him a second chance. I'm not saying I don't want to heal him, but, uh, yeah. I think he's pretty gone. <laughs> Jade, you are witnessing all this. Do you have anything to chime in? Not really. I'm, that thing kind of scared the crap out Fuck of me. Fuck him up, guys! <laughs> Jake, I mean, <laughs> if if he's gonna if he's gonna die, I mean, I guess I could I could exercise his last rites. All right, uh, you guys can choose to let him go if you want. Um, Zero saber at that point. <laughs> don't thinks, don't say it like that. What do you mean, let him go? You like he's let dead, him right? Let him die. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay, I'm just, I'm just making to... sure there's not some bullshit where we let him out into space and he's some kind. Of, comes back alive and he's ten times bigger or something. <laughs> <laughs> no, he... sure if, if, there's anything, if we did want to save him, if, if there's anything Scarlet could do. Uh, Scarlet is Jared a healer. The virus, maybe. No, but I mean, uh, she's she speaks with the spirits, though. I don't know if that gets rid of. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just trying. I'm just thinking of options, really. Uh, Zero Saber goes into the back and gets some painkillers. <laughs> you are sorry. Uh, Zero Saber goes to the this area and grabs some painkillers. No wonder the guy that's their leader. Everyone's uh, shirking I off their duties. <laughs> oh no, he brings back a syringe full of it, and he says, "At least, at least, let me make it painless." He says, "Oh yeah, yeah." I I say we just we give him a proper funeral. I mean, we we tried to revive him, and that didn't work. And he obviously wanted to destroy the planet. So yeah, his he's a he's a angry. Uh, thing. This would probably be best. It might be... Yeah. I-, I can... Uh, I have my backpack on me still, right? Well, gather gather all the little ones. Yeah, you've you know, got... the, ship, the ship's fine, so... You've got your background. Or, your your what? My backpack. You've got your backpack. Yeah, so I probably would have this uh, maybe. Fine. Someone. Do the... Do so. the. Does it matter if I take the Deoxys Pokeballs? Because everyone's shouting about it. <laughs> you can take them. And cool. you can, yeah. you can, uh, even though you can't master the Pokemon inside, you can still at least recall everything. All right, fine. I take all three and I recall. Well. All of the, everyone, just comes back in, and they gather around Burb. The little Emelgium, uh start floating around, and they're all giving, uh, they're all playing, uh, different <laughs> lights around him. Just like a like a kind of funeral pyre. This is actually very fascinating for Jade because she's probably taking like little taking like little mental notes of how they're doing this. The Emelgium gather around a burb, and so do um, the Behem Behem, and they start playing uh, just soft music that fills your head as Zero reaches down with a syringe and injects a, an overdose of painkillers into him. Oh gosh. Painkillers. Uh, with that, you can feel the final uh, remains of Burb's uh, mental state just fade from the hive mind, and he is no longer with you. Uh, the rest of the Amelgium start to um, not cry, but give off like a like a mourn, mourning sound. And Zero Saber picks him up and uh, takes him to a part of the machine over here. The ship is temporarily suspended into like a silent, like a, like a silent hum or it's put into, I'm trying to think of a good analogy. Static. Kind of like, kind of like the end of the Guardians of the Galaxy movie. 
Yeah. That too. And with that, uh, his body does disappear into the engines, and the ship uh, calmly comes back to life um, as the song ends. And the Amelgem just float around the lot of you.